In this video, I will show you how you can use a slider control in Power Apps to move a dialog box anywhere on the screen. So you can see I have a dialog box here. I can move it from left to right and up and down using the slider control. So let's see how we can build this. I will first create a header and footer layout. I'll select the main container, change the color to peach. You can choose any color you want. Then I'm going to insert a vertical container. Move it right here. I'm going to change the background color of this container to a light blue. Let's use this blue. Next, I'm going to insert a slider. You create a label. I'm going to say move to move up and down. I'm going to copy both of these. And paste. I'm going to change this to move left and right. I'm going to call this slider up and down slider. I'm going to select this slider, rename it, and call it left to right slider. When I play this, I can move the sliders left and right and up and down, but I want to move the dialog box as I'm moving the sliders from left to right and up and down. To do that, I'm going to select the container in the X property of the container. I'm going to change this to point to the left and right slider control dot value. Left to right slider dot value. I will do the same for the Y property. So it will be up to down slider dot value. Just like this. Now when I play it, 
I can move the slider left to right and up and down. Now you notice that my maximum for the slider is 100 for both. I can adjust those by selecting the slider to find out the max. I need to move the dialog box all the way to the right. You'll see that the max is 100 and 850. So let's make the max of the left and right slider to 850. We move the slider or the dialog box all the way down to the bottom and go to the Y property. You see the max is 450. So we'll change the up and down slider to max number to 450. Since we adjusted the X and Y properties of the dialog box, we need to point to the sliders again. So the Y property will be the up and down slider dot value and the X property of the dialog box will be left to right slider dot value. So now when I play, I can go all the way to 850 to the right and all the way down to 450 to the bottom. 